the Lacie booth with Gaspard Plantreau. Yes. And uh, I think we're going to be talking about Thunderbolt 3 and we're going to have some fun here. What do you got going for us today? So today we're uh, presenting the latest product we just announced last week. So this is the Too Big Dock. Uh, it's our new uh, Thunderbolt 3 product to complete the whole range. Uh, this drive is up to 20 terabytes to connect to your uh, new MacBook Pro. And we've added all the new uh, the dock functionalities inside. So you can connect USB, contact flash, SD card directly on the product and it will show up on your MacBook Pro. Uh, it comes with five years warranty, the best in class drive you can find uh, in Seagate. And it's, we think, the perfect uh, companion for the new MacBook Pro. So um, this is uh, audio and video. So what he's pointing to is a sort of a small unit, actually. It doesn't look like a giant unit compared to the one next to us here, but it's called Too Big Thunderbolt 3. So it's Thunderbolt 3 over USB-C, is that correct? Exactly. So we have Thunderbolt 3 and USB, uh, so that you can connect to a MacBook Pro or to any Windows machine on the market. Uh, it brings speeds up to nearly 500 megabytes per second, so you can transfer a lot of picture in a fairly small amount of time. So on the front of it, we've got, let's uh, zoom in here, Steve. So we've got uh, an SD card slot, is that uh, compact, flash. compact flash and, and a regular USB. USB? Yes. All right, right on the front of it. And uh, it's it's very long for a drive. Not that much. If you I mean, check with the, uh, we got a bare drive here. So you can see that we only have a little space on the bottom okay. for a fan. Okay. So this and is the, the interfaces. So. so these are 10 terabyte drives in here? Yeah, I want the Seagate so. Iron yeah. Wolves. Okay. Best in class. Uh, those are the, 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 um, the drives that are built to work in a multi-drive environment. So they come with five years warranty. They have a lot of sensors to synchronize, uh, mechanically speaking, the drive between the, the two of them so that data is not corrupted. Okay, so it's it's uh, mirroring between the two? Or you've, you're saying you, 20 terabytes, but you got a 10 terabyte drive there. Yeah, you've got two drives inside. Okay. So you can choose either to be mirroring the two of them or to, to configure them in red zero for optimal speeds. Okay. So if okay. you're mirroring, you will go up to 10 terabyte, which is definitely a lot, still a lot. But if you want, if you are into speed, you configure them in red zero and you go up to 450 megabytes per second. Wow. Okay. So who's this, who's this for? Who needs this? This is for uh, video professionals and uh, professional photographers. Uh, the one that have acquired this brand new MacBook Pro that uh, need capacity and speed and that are starting, uh, that are not in the need for 60 terabyte drive, but rather small uh, HD production. productions. Yes. Okay. So he just pointed at another drive set here that's 60 terabytes. What about this? Uh, he's got one here that's the size of a small filing cabinet. Yeah. <laughs> what is that so one? So this one we announced at NAB last year. We started shipping uh, back in December. This is the six B, uh, sorry, the 12 big Thunderbolt 3. So it has such as this one, uh, Thunderbolt 3 and USB-C. So you can connect to any Thunderbolt 3 machine such as this one or any machine in the market thanks to USB. It comes in uh, up to 120 terabytes. Uh, you can transfer one hour of uh, raw 4K footage in less than five minutes. Holy cow. So Holy that's cow. around 2,600 megabytes per second capable. Wow. Okay, so I don't probably need that one yet, but we'll, uh, we'll work our way up to it. So this is for 4K and up. This is for 4K and down. So 4K and down, the two big Thunderbolt 3, and that's the one you're just announcing right exactly. now, right? Exactly. That's kind of a nice compact unit. I heard somebody ask you about pricing. You don't have pricing yet? Or? No, we don't have pricing yet. Okay, and when is that going to be available? Uh, early summer. Three? Yeah, I forgot to say that this is a four-in-one dock. So on top of all the extensions we have here, the dock actually provides power directly to the MacBook Pro. So how many milliamp hours is that? So we're, talk uh, sorry, we're talking about watts, so up to 27 watts. Okay, great. Now you've got one of your classic Lacie orange drives yeah. and uh, it's got a, uh, oh, oh shoot, I'm sorry, I knocked that out of your hands. Problem. <laughs> It's a, it's a, uh, basically you could give this to a small child, right? And it's uh, yeah, not going to break. Of course, of course. This is shy safe. Uh, so we, uh, at the beginning of the year, we've updated the interfaces on the, on the product. So this is a Thunderbolt interface, a legacy Thunderbolt, I would say, and we've updated with USB-C so that it can connect to basically any MacBook, either if it has on, uh, Thunderbolt 3 only, such as this one, or the previous generation. Of course, it's also compatible with Windows, so it's uh, shock resistant, 
Uh, this is great for throwing in your bag when you're going on a exactly. shoot or something. You don't have to care about the cable, it's integrated. Uh, it's great for your bag. Uh, it's widely used as a shuttle drive on the market and it goes up to five terabytes. Oh wow, so this is the rugged USB-C Thunderbolt, is a rugged USB-C Thunderbolt drive. Exactly. And is this already on the market? Yes. And how much does this one cost? Depending on size. Depending on size, <laughs> definitely. And uh, where would people find out more about these drives? Oh, you can, uh, to get more information, just visit lacie.com. Lacie.com, that's L-A-C-I-E -E dot com. Yes. I'm asking you to spell in English, there you go. Thank you very much. I You're very welcome. Your time.